I'm here to watch the reform attempt fail. Let's just say I need to better myself for the future of society. If I want my future wife to appreciate me, I need to be not mentally ill from League. I'll still try hard, but I gotta I gotta change for the better. Always bitching. Guess your mods are even a bigger bitch. It's not that serious. You are bitching for minutes of the game. Well, that, that's that's expected. Nothing better than playing Graze into f Jax. Very playable. For your information. Oh yeah, we should invade. We should definitely invade. I kind of buy a pot too. So I think we're gonna fight level one. I think there's gonna be a fight here. There's no way he makes Jax leash, right? Their level one's pretty strong too. But Aphelios is weak. Pike's strong. Silas is strong. Panther is also pretty strong as high base armor. Imagine our top was here. I mean, we probably lose. If Pike and Panther in front line like that, it's a loss because they have like 50 base armor level one. That's like more like 40, but still. I mean, they're what? Three melee champs were three ranged. I think we actually win level one. I just got shit on. Good enough, I guess. Pretty big. Honestly, Pike hooking me there was so bad. But Nautilus insta flashing was so good too. They can stop me on Crooks if they want. They honestly should. But we, if we could get mid push him and dive easily. So Solus can't TP. But hell, he died. TP's enemies the tower. No heal on Aphelios either. I mean, it's, it's easy dive. Pent died as Grom. <laughs> Okay. Holy shit, the game is over through vault. This guy actually played perfect early game. He actually played perfect, unironically. And despite dying, it's just... <laughs> this guy ran bot? That ward actually got me killed. I could have healed off crab blue and rent back bot. Aftershock Pike, yeah, the Zico guy is a special case. How Pant died a fucking Gromp? It actually got me killed that he died, because then he's reselling map with Home Guard. I mean, I want to gank top, but like, bot is like so perma for him, I can't start bot too. I protect my blue side, they can invade, but I don't think they will. Just to be safe. Top was also an angle, but since my only camps are up and bot lane has no sums, it's just a lot better to sit here and play through bot. He's already winning top too. Pant can be here though. Oh, I got in reset. I mean, I should just leave. Yeah, I figured I can't heal off Krugs there. In case Pant is here. This guy hasn't been reset once. Pike is not here, but Pant should be almost six. His blue's up too. Reset aggro, go again. Dead. Nice. My top one actually knew how to dive properly. But that's how you aggro. First, use your spells for the initial dive. Bait his spells, reset aggro, go again. Yeah, I know he wouldn't start this without his support here, but I think he got off. Look that he got off, and no, I didn't. Let's just rush these so I can't get one shot. Thoughts? The only play right now is mid or top, so I have to cover at least one. Maybe my red buff is gone too. I think we're fine though. If I can secure this drag. My stacks, not listen and pull it, so I have to W it. Yes, do you know I'm here? Why would you do that? I have stacks on my E, I can E in easily. That guy's trying to win. I might be able to maw this game anyways. Magic damage from these two. 
Yeah, I knew my R wouldn't kill Pike there. That's why I didn't R early, but I guess he just entered anyways. easily. Okay, not easily. I had eight stacks and I still got fucking shit on. Plus I used my autos on ground to get the heal, but I guess it was bad. I think I should have merge treads. I think I fucked up going tabby. So I'm gonna get frozen heart anyways. I made a mistake. I should also push mid here. I don't know why my rules this is actually so we should have went bot should have pushed mid. I mean, I don't even know why they're dying. Why are they? What are, what are they doing, actually? Should let me go. Let me buy Black Cleaver first because the components are just at perfect gold. Yeah, I can just do Blue Gromp Crap 12. Probably play for Bot Tower. Actually, I don't know. Do you even beat Jax TV1? I mean, probably, but it'll be hard. Jax probably took crowd to be honest. Obscene level is a top laner. Maybe jungle is broken. When you play Graves and just farm all game. This guy takes... Holy shit. He doesn't even have tabbing. That's my damage. I need no damage to Jax, actually insane with his R. That's why I hate this Graves character. <laughs> so useless. Luckily it's not the worst Black Cleaver game, so I'm gonna do some damage eventually, but I'm still far off. <laughs> Is this I'm actually just like not doing nothing to him. Yeah, that's allowed. <laughs> yeah, Philios, that's fucking allowed. Kill this dip. Closest minute we still win this. Damn, if I had R here. One second for gore. Oh shit. ADC's weak dispatch. Yeah, this, this is really fun to play Graves and Jax. Like, if you have Jax, Teemo, or Yasu against Graves, your odds of winning are just so fucking small. It's fine. If you can't beat him, join him. I'll build the same item, man. I don't have smite. What am I saying? I don't know. I don't know why Camille is not top with TP. I don't think he understands land assignments. If you see me top, they're gonna go in. Silas can probably even TP behind my teammates. It's the only way we lose. But Zyko's so bad that I don't know if we can lose. Basically, we're doing what we, well, like Camille should be doing. Like, me and Camille should invert roles. I should be there, Camille should be top with TP. But for some reason, he's grouped, but it's we're so ahead of the matter. So lane assignments are so important, but people just still don't know them. So I'm more useful than Kimmel anyways, but just TP. I don't have TP. They can force 5v4 on us from their base. My fleet healed more than is executed. They're back to the real show, I suppose.